What is up, ladies and gentlemen? It's your new refrigerator tube, and today we're opening the brand new set, Dimension Force. Honestly, other than these blister packs and probably one booster box to crack for some weekly videos, I'm probably not going to go too deep into this set, uh, considering I sell some Battle of Chaos set. I want to try and pull a Dark Magician out of, and we have some Grand Creators. Which we've been really lucky with that. So we might get a collector's rare of that. But if we can get a Starlight Rare out of one of these blister packs. Or the one box we buy. It'll be pretty insane. The odds of that are heavily against us. But you know. We've we've conquered great odds before. Um, obviously if you guys saw last week's video. You saw we pulled the Dark Magician Girl Ghost Rare. So... Maybe we'll get some good luck and we can pull that. Apparently, everything in my life is against me right now. So I'm going to have to lower the volume here just a bit because the pipes in the background decided to go on. And I've already started. I've already opened a pack, so I'm not going to stop. We got a super rare, which I would imagine is in every pack. So nothing crazy here. An ultra rare, secret rare. Secret rares, you, we can get uh, pre-sale. I think most secret rares are around twenty to thirty dollars. Uh, there are some lower valued ones, but you can get some pretty decent valued ones. The starlight rares are obviously the ones that you really want to get f go for. They are the uh, the moon egg cards, which to this day <laughs> we have still not pulled a single starlight rare. So. I mean, we pulled the Ghost Rare. We pulled a couple Ghost Rares, which is awesome. We even pulled the Ghost Rare from a Monster Box, which is obviously super against you because it's a it's a Mystery Box. You know, it's not. There's nothing guaranteed in that. You could get absolute dog water out of that. But there are some really cool Starlight Rares in here. Well, I think I only saw two. Is that right? Is there only two? Correct me if I'm wrong. And the pre-sale value of both of them were like 300 to 400 dollars, which for a starlight rare seems on on brand because they are uh, extremely hard to pull. Uh, of course, we're not gonna. So far, it's not looking too good, which is surprising because we've always done well with blister packs. Maybe it's because we haven't done a blister pack opening in a while, so these blister packs. Are shunning me for not opening them more. It's just so much more easy. It's so much cheaper to buy boxes and spread it out than to buy blisters, especially when Walmart prices are going up. Four fifty a pack, like it's a bit excessive. Another super rare, yeah. So they are pretty, pretty normal here. These are we are we are only doing ten packs today, so. Uh, and I believe yesterday was probably our last Ghost Rare opening. Uh, for a while, at least. We still have a full case to crack into, but we, we kind of want to save that. Because uh, just like the last Ghost in the past set, uh, it, it kind of came and went fast on most channels, to be honest with you. <laughs> Can we get at least one Ultra Rare? I want a Starlight Rare. I really do. I've never pulled one. The only time I've ever held one is at work. <laughs> to grade one. But. Never pulled one. <sighs> maybe one day. Maybe one day. Let's see. If we can at least get an ultra rare, <laughs> can we at least get an ultra rare? This might be the most depressing video ever. This might have potential. I'll take an ultra rare. I don't I, like this is. Did I like use up all my luck on one card? Like. I mean, I'm gu I was guaranteed. Well, not guaranteed. I was basically gu seven packs and all super rares. 
That is absolutely ludicrous. <sighs> Come on, Dimension Force. Give me give me something, guys. Give me give me something. Anything. Anything, please. This this is potentially one of the worst openings on the channel. <laughs> we got an ultra <laughs> Finally We got something Oh man Let's look let's take a look at it. Deer note, huh? Deer note punk. <sighs> we got an ultra. <laughs> I know these are not guaranteed pull rates, but like, I have never had this bad of pull rates before in a blister pack, in a blister pack set. I've, almost every time I have pulled a, a secret rare, and today is telling me no. Oh, there we go! Actually... This this might actually be a really good secret rare, cause this is this is one of the starlight rares, so this one's getting treatment. This one's getting one of those cool pharaoh uh, Egyptian sleeves. Shut up, phone. You guys probably didn't hear that cause the volume's down. That that has the potential to be an actual valuable secret rare. So, thank thank you thank you thank you, obelisk. Slifer and Raw, thank you so much for looking down upon me today. <laughs> Giving me a pull. Oh, so we went Ultra Rare, Secret. Does that mean we're getting a Starlight Rare now? Does that mean we're getting a Starlight Rare? A lot of you are probably like, dude, you got like seven old uh, supers in a row. You're not getting a Starlight. You're probably right. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> yeah, I went back to Super, which is unfortunate. <laughs> But it is what it is. Hey, guys, at least, at least we got, I think, probably one of the best secrets in the set. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, hit that like button. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. We're trying to hit 1,000 subscribers by the end of the year. Thank you, guys, and I'll see you guys in the next video.